Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the second, okay? So keep in mind that not every reading is for you. This reading may or may not be for you. What do we have for a message today? Eight of Pentacles. Eight of Cups reversed. Two of Cups. Two of Cups. So putting in effort, working hard. Somebody is working hard on a partnership, working hard with another person, putting in a lot of effort. Eight of Cups in the past, though, is in reversed. Somebody may have left. Now they're going to be putting in effort. I don't know if they're coming back around. Somebody may be coming back around. They want to they want to put in effort. And this doesn't have to be a love relationship. It's two people working together, you know, because somebody that may have departed at some point. Maybe they went down another path in their life. Now they're coming back. You know, they're coming back. They want to work on a partnership. They want to work together. Page of Pentacles reversed next to that Two of Cups. Now that is... Page of Pentacles reversed is, well, we have a partnership. We have Page of Pentacles reversed is somebody that typically is a dropout. You know, this is somebody that drops out or doesn't follow through, loses interest. Somebody may have lost interest in a partnership or they dropped out. They didn't want commitment. Three of Pentacles. Now that's working together working as a team putting in definitely putting in effort i feel like we have somebody here that didn't follow through you know they didn't put in effort but now they're going to they want to work together now somebody wants to work together they want to they want to communicate they're ready to cooperate you know that page of pentacles reverse that's like a that's laziness so hmm Knight of Wands. Wow. Now that is uh, coming in fast. It's a fierce approach. Somebody making an approach. Doing it. It's like taking action right now. And it's right next to the Two of Cups. So this is somebody that is coming in really, really fast. They got this burning desire to work together. They're going to put in effort. But they did drop out. They didn't something happened with that page of pentacles reverse maybe they didn't want commitment or they weren't really interested or something like that three of pentacles maybe they were in a third party what is this third three of pentacles severing ties devil reversed so I'm, I'm wondering if somebody has severed ties with somebody, with a third party or with somebody else, you know, and that's why now that they've broken free, here they come. Now they want to put in effort to something that is more compatible. Okay. Um, you know, it's like, here I come, here I come. I want to work with you. I want to work with you. So this may this may even be a job opportunity but somebody is coming in really 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 fast they've severed ties with somebody that probably wasn't working out it didn't work out it didn't be with it's right next to the page of pentacles if something didn't work out they may have left they thought you know they left now they're coming back they're coming back around they may have been pretending that something was else was working. They may have been in a you know place where they were refusing to take a new approach. They weren't seeing clearly uh, something like that. But this is like coming back around after a departure. That's what I feel. It's like severing ties, breaking free um, from something that is very unhealthy and toxic. Maybe they weren't interested because they were already with, communicating with somebody else or working with somebody else. Maybe them ties have now been severed. Now they want to work. They want to put in effort into another partnership. Hmm. Fool reverse. So yeah, somebody made a foolish decision in the past. They did. They may have walked away foolishly. Maybe they were naive. They they but there's some sort of unfinished business here. 
Six of Pentacles. There may have been rejection. Maybe somebody didn't get what they deserve. They were treated unfairly or there was an abuse of generosity or an abuse of power. There's been some sort of rejection. Somebody has been rejected. They reject, they foolishly rejected another person. They made a poor judgment call. The fool reverse is a poor judgment call. Maybe they stayed in a unfulfilling situation. You know, they pretended they were happy, you know, and they couldn't leave because, I don't know, maybe they were lazy um, or they were codependent, you know, but this is severing those codependent ties. Uh, going in a new direction very 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 fast towards a partnership that is extremely compatible i feel like this is this is something working out you know putting in a lot of effort into a partnership probably very suddenly after there has been some sort of severing of ties somebody may have even uh, been let go Nine of Cups, going after wish fulfillment, going after happiness. I want to have it all. You know, the Nine of Cups is, is like, I want to have it all. Leaving the emotionally disappointing situation in heading towards, you know, abundance. So we do have somebody here that is making a serious uh, attempt to, I feel like, communicate and collaborate and... Uh, create something it's like they want to they want to create now together they want to they're going to be using their skills to uh it's almost like entice i feel like entice another person taking action right now Somebody is taking action right now. It's like there's no stopping them. It's like. It's very fast as well. Fast. Moving very, very fast towards wish fulfillment after there's been some sort of. Severing of ties. Somebody is going to be expressing their feelings suddenly or they're going to be expressing their interest after they weren't interested because they were tied to something that they were codependent on that they couldn't break free from maybe because of they were lazy or they didn't want to start over. They could have been, you know, their ego might have been in the way. You know, I didn't want to start over. I didn't want to start. I didn't want to put in the work of starting over. But this is like a change. It is. star right next to the nine of cups these are both wish fulfillment okay these are both you know a blessing okay so somebody is definitely going with that knight of wands after wish fulfillment this is a big bright opportunity for happiness extreme happiness i mean a star is a card of hope it's a card of renewal this is unexpected help arriving, guaranteed success, breaking free from that codependent toxic situation and taking action right now will bring guaranteed success and abundance. But it will require communication, collaboration, and hard work. And I feel like we have somebody here that is about to put in a lot of effort. I feel like they made a foolish decision to stay put in a situation that was emotionally unfulfilling, but there may have been a rejection now. They may have been let go by that person or they let themselves go. There's been an abuse of generosity. Somebody was, uh, there's been an injustice here. Uh, somebody was, uh, I don't know if they were stolen from or they were rejected or they're in a one-sided partnership and they, you know, just, there's just like a sudden departure, you know, maybe things change suddenly. It's a sudden change. I do believe it's a sudden change. Somebody may be suddenly realizing that something is their wish fulfillment. I mean, we definitely have wish fulfillment here. A wish is being granted. 
somebody's wish is being granted and this is a very healing energy a healing partnership this is this is having it all this is like sitting pretty it's like oh oh boy Breaking free brings wish fulfillment. Be prepared to put in the work. But this is a this is like a well match made in heaven. Two of cups, that's a match. The ace of wands in that knight of wands hands, that's a match, and the star card is heaven. It's a match made in heaven. There could be a sudden arrival here. These two people are going to work very, very, very well together. But if there's some sort of fear with the full reverse, that's fear. There's fear. There's fear of rejection. Maybe that's why this person stayed put because they were afraid that they were going to be rejected by the perfect match. But this is definitely a sudden change. Breaking free from fear, taking action right now. Communication, collaborating, working together. Deep fulfillment is coming. That's the Nine of Cups and the Star card. That's deep fulfillment. Breaking free from this toxic behavior, this toxic situation brings deep fulfillment. Moon reverse. Moon reverse is a reality check. Check. It's letting go of fear. Seeing very clearly. Coming out of darkness. Truth is being revealed. Seeing the truth. Stepping out of the darkness. So we have somebody here that is, there's some sort of reveal here. Somebody's going to be revealing their intentions, revealing their, their dreams, going after their dreams, stepping out of a darkness, stepping out of a dark place where they may have been in illusion. A sudden approach, taking action. Breaking free. Putting in a lot of effort. Somebody was naive. They stayed put in a dissatisfying situation because of fear of rejection. Because it's scary. Because it's risky. Because it's so much work. But the star card is a card of acceptance. So there is acceptance. As soon as you accept the truth, as soon as you honor the truth as soon as you step out of that dark place there's guaranteed success you know the star card is a blessing it's a blessing in disguise after the tower has fallen so if somebody was rejected by a player that was toxic and unhealthy. Consider it a blessing in disguise. You're about to work together with somebody that you are very compatible with. And I don't know if this is a work partner or if it's a relationship. But whatever this is, it's exciting. It's fresh. It's not toxic. It's healing. King of Cups reversed, emotions all over the place. Somebody uh, has severed ties with an individual that didn't have good intentions. It's right next to the devil reversed. They, they severed ties with somebody who doesn't want commitment, that isn't committed, that isn't interested in love. So they're, they're, this is somebody that is not very loving, somebody that is emotionally withdrawn, somebody that... Uh, they were codependent on maybe for materialistic reasons 
Anyway, we definitely have somebody here that is severing ties with an individual that is not very loving, not very gentle, not very kind, breaking free. There's no stability here. There's no commitment here. Going in a new direction towards a partnership that is going to work out. As soon as somebody finds their strength and stamina and willpower and confidence to take action, I do believe we have somebody here that is going to take action. And we have a bright future ahead. This is beautiful. This is a new beginning. This is a life-giving energy. This is a breakthrough. It is a turning point. It's beautiful. This is a yes. You will be accepted. So somebody is definitely taking action. And this is happy, 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 happy. It's a happy result. It's beautiful. It's bright. A bright new beginning. A life-giving energy. This is a new vibration. Going to a warm place. Enjoying life, right? This is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful new beginning. Where there is love. Because sun, the sun is a card of love. This is extreme happiness where you will be accepted. It's so definitely a very positive, positive, positive change. With the, with the sun card, you're shining. In the star card, you're shining. This is shining. This is, this is glowing. It is beautiful. This is like... What's the word for it? Thrilled. That wasn't the word that I was going for, but uh, so happy. So, 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 so happy. This is like, I'm so happy I did this. I'm so happy I took this risk because the Knight of Wands is very risky. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm free. I'm free. The devil is, I'm free. I'm free. I'm free from that loveless, unrequited situation there where I wasn't getting taken care of and I wasn't getting any reciprocation. I was so stupid to stay there. I'm so happy. I'm free. I'm so happy. You know, I'm so happy. And now working together with somebody that you see eye to eye with and it's you know it's easy it's an easy connection where you're just accepted for who you are sounds like a dream come true <laughs> oh, hope it's for you if it is get prepared for an arrival or something very exciting to happen okay good luck